I have three lectures and one tutorial every week for each of my three modules and my lectures vary in size from, I don't know, 50 to kind of 100 odd. Um, and my tutorials are much smaller groups of kind of up to six, which is really nice. I found that in the US, uh, since we only had like, well, we would have an hour long class time, which would incorporate both the lecture aspect, aspect and what is a tutorial aspect here in one 50 minute slot. I wouldn't engage in the topics that we were studying in the US as deeply beyond what I was given in class. Um, whereas here, I'm encouraged to not only read the primary materials, but read secondary sources and really delve more deeply into those topics on my own. Lectures are mostly, um, while they do sometimes give an overview of a subject, they also really capitalize on the experience of the lecturers who are doing their own independent research themselves. I find that I really am learning deeply the topics that I'm studying here in a lot of cases, as opposed to a much more shallow uh, understanding of the topics that I learned in the US. Obviously St Andrews has a reputation for having amazing teaching but in my experience it's definitely stood up to that. Um, the fact that teachers are kind of really willing and kind of encourage you to go to them if there's anything that you should need, if there's anything you want to ask and you definitely get the impression that they want to help and that's with tutors as well as lecturers. Lecturers always kind of hang around at the end and say if there's any questions please come and ask me and they always give their email address. So there's really open lines of communication, which I really appreciate. I found that St. Andrews is really research-based. I have a lab at two today and two tomorrow, and it's always uh, very engaging. And like, all these things you learn in the university, you're going to use in your uh, career if you want to be a researcher, for example. Beyond lectures, we have tutorials every week where we split into much smaller class sizes um, and discuss the topics at hand. I especially actually love tutorials because I ha just having that space to discuss um, topics with other students and with lecturers as well um, is just really refreshing and it's it's so important because I guess especially with sustainable development and international relations there's a lot of discussions about very topical issues and to like really have that deep discussions around what what's happening in the world and how we can deal with that and like what are the answers and like gra grappling with like really difficult questions is really rewarding. And I feel like I really get the opportunity to engage with the material and engage with the tutors uh, and also I get to benefit from the knowledge of my tutorial mates um, and I've been really impressed with the like breadth and depth of experience that a lot of the undergraduate students here are able to bring to the table. So for English especially um, we kind of have a group of six of us and it's an opportunity to discuss kind of the text, the parts of the text that we want to discuss. So whereas the lecture, lectures are obviously led by what the lecturer has prepared and different themes that they want to discuss, the tutorial is kind of a more open space where um, it's really easy to ask questions about things that you don't understand or things that you're just interested in. Um, and I found that, yeah, we've all kind of gelled as a group this semester especially, which has been really great. And to have um, lectures of such expertise in St Andrews that can share their knowledge um, and can inspire us is, is really great. And then on top of that, all of my tutors have always been willing to offer office hours and things like that. So there's definitely the opportunity to get individual advice and support should you need it. Like moving from high school to university, still having that kind of one-to-one -one contact has been really great. I kind of always knew exactly what I wanted to study. And the thing with colleges in the States is that you, most of them you have to take core classes. And I knew, for example, that I wasn't really a big fan of biology and I never wanted to step foot in a biology lab again. I think that's where St. Andrews is really good. Um, and that if you know which subjects you're interested in from a state's perspective, like it's more narrow and that like you can just go and take them. If I had stayed in the States, I would have had to be paying for classes I didn't want to necessarily take.